안녕하세요. Hello, YouTube. This is DKDKTV. Danny, David, Leo. Uh, welcome to the first episode of Korea Booze, where we taste out Korean booze and also show you all sorts of things related to Korean booze. Today, uh, we have some Korean beer right now here. Korean beer has a very bad reputation for tasting like shit. While they do taste like shit, uh, we decided that we want to pick the cream of the crap. This is beer that like you can find in every single convenience store, right? So this is this is like the most common beers, and you could say these are like the Budweisers or the like the Coors Lights of uh, Korea. We have our beer expert here, uh, Leo. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. I am. Yes, I am. Yeah. Let's just go. Okay. So here we have the height extra, extra cold, cold uh, beer. Is it extra cold? Warm. It's warm. It's warm. <laughs> it's warm. <laughs> and this is the Max All Malt Beer since 2006. Okay. And this is Kas. I think this is the most popular uh, in Korea, right? Uh, Kas Fresh. And this is Lager Beer with non pasteurized ultimate freshness. Cloud 100% Malt Classic. Newcomer that's becoming really popular, mm. right? Mm. OB Premier Pilsner. Beer. So this is, I think, my my grandpa's favorite. This is quite yeah. old, right? Mm -hmm. So okay, just a typical Korean beer. Okay, nothing special, I think. So like, what's the flavor? It's water. Oh, like carbonated water. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> There's no flavor to it. Mm. It's like really watered down. I don't think it I could call this beer, right? Water with gas inside. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Mm. There's not even a lot of like carbonated feel. It tastes like soy sauce. So why is it extra cold? I think it has some kind of like... It's a special can maybe? Uh, mm. Not sure. Okay, whatever. It tastes like shit anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Next, we have the Max Cream All Malt Beer. So this is like darker than other beers. So I guess mm. it has more profound flavor. It has a fruity smell. Okay, okay. <laughs> Compared to this, which smells like water. It smells oh, like yeah. it has more fruity. Oh, oh yeah, this definitely is more fruity. I think I might actually enjoy this, just from the uh, smell. Mm. It actually, is more fruity. It, it's better? It's more fruity. I think it has an orange taste. So let me try to enhance the flavor. <laughs> <laughs> like once you put the air in, you can kind of like feel the like flavors mm. playing around with in your mouth, right? Mm. I think he's spitting out. <laughs> <laughs> this tastes good. Not bad. Yeah, this Not actually uh, this is like citrus kind of taste. But it's weird because I don't see any ingredients here. Like no fruit ingredients, but it tastes like fruit. Now moving on to Kaz Fresh. No difference between height. Tastes like piss. <laughs> Did you taste piss before? Sometimes. Actually, I missed something. <laughs> it pretty much is the same with height. Yeah, I can't really tell the difference. I think this is more shittier. They look <coughs> the same. They taste the same. Uh huh. Do they just like change the packaging? <laughs> Maybe. Maybe they're made from the same place. I personally think this has a stronger finish. This just tastes like water. <laughs> this tastes like. Uh, a little bit more carbonated this water. This is more sour. Mm, yeah, it has a sour uh, finish. Okay, let's go on to Cloud. I think Cloud is a pretty okay beer. Mm. <laughs> so it's more soft than Kas or Height. Okay. It doesn't have a pissy smell. Mm. That's that's good. That's a good start. <laughs> it just smells like water, but the taste is more uh, deeper mm. than its smell. Mm. Mm, it definitely has a more rich flavor. Mm. Mm. It, it's more sophisticated. I think this actually kind of feels like an expensive beer. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, kind of. It's kind like, of. It's it, like comfortable. You, yeah. you don't get that frown when you first taste it. Yeah, yeah, stuff. exactly. And I think that's less gassy than these. Two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. On to OB Premier. Danny's grandpa. My grandpa's favorite. favorite. And this is actually a Pilsner. Oh, it has a different color. Okay, yeah. So it's more like Max. 
It tastes like nacho. Nacho? It's nacho? Like salty. It's salty. It's salty? It salty. makes me think of a volcano in Japan. What? It feels like licking a pagangang. Okay. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. I definitely get what you mean by salty. Mm. It is very salty. So do you get why I said making mm, 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 mm. You are an expert. It tastes like salt mm. water with a little bit of carbon. So this is gas water. Gas water with some fruit. Gas water. <laughs> gas with good water. <laughs> yeah, very air water. <laughs> water and salt. Yeah. And some fruit. <laughs> mm. Mm. I can feel the sea. Mm. I kind of, I think it kind of it's similar to foreign beer. They like what? Carls Carlsberg? Yeah. Mm. Mm. Yeah, Carlsberg. It's it's not my cup of tea, but I think this mm. doesn't taste like really cheap ass beer as mm. these one. These Whoa. do. Wait, wait. I just noticed that this has just a clear, clean smell, but this kind of stinks. This, this smell is way more uh, light yeah. than this one. This has mm. a kind of a strong uh, scent. To it. Oh, and this thing. This, like this smells like piss. Yeah. I actually smelled this before uh, in oh, France yeah. <laughs> near the Seine River where everybody pissed. <laughs> piss. Smell this at Yuzon no, no, in oh. the Green Line. Oh, so let's just rate. Uh, for me, OB is the best. The smell, the taste, mm -hmm. and the philosophy inside the beer. Philosophy. Uh, it all matches. <laughs> Obi is the best, and the second is Cloud. It doesn't smell good, but you know it's so soft that it makes me think of drinking good water. And the third is Max. This smells good. It has an orange taste. Mm. And then uh, this is the most difficult part: cost or height. Mm. Picking the shit. You can just both discard. <laughs> Picking that. the shit. Yeah. Big difference the of taste, it, yeah. so I'll just. I like blue, so I'll pick Cuff. Okay. This is my best pick. Uh, and I think this has the most sophisticated and it feels doesn't feel like a cheap beer like all the other beers and Second pick I'm gonna go with Obi yeah, as well mm -hmm. again it, It's it's less cheap tasting and it doesn't taste like water. It actually has flavor whereas this all tastes like water mm -hmm. But this has a more of a sophisticated uh, Taste it feels like I'm copying you man. This you are it actually has flavor This is third it actually has flavor these two I can't just, I, I, I can't decide. They're both shit, absolute, like, just tragedies. I don't know why people would actually drink this. Or maybe these two uh, go pretty well with soju. I think so, yeah. I think they're meant to be with soju. They're mixers. So Your my opinion. first is Obi. <coughs> okay. It smells like the sea. Mm -hmm. And it kind of, it's kind of similar to European here. Mm -hmm. My next is Max. What? Wow. Really? Next is you Max have cheap taste, man. Because this kind of <laughs> smells good and it actually has like fruit flavor. Mm -hmm. Next is Cloud. Uh, okay. But I, I admit that it tastes good. It's it's kind of like very, very clean, mm -hmm. kind of like in the middle. Like I don't know where it could be categorized, like mm -hmm. strong or weak mm -hmm. or just like mm -hmm. if I like go for strong stuff, I'd go for this or if I want cheap, here, I go for like these two mm -hmm. and I think Kass is better really? okay. because marketing wise it does a lot of like very young stuff yeah, it's like the music, Red Bull music of Korea yeah. music festival yeah. and this it, it just it uses Song Joong Gi so I recommend if you if you want to just have a good night or a good good supper or whatever mm -hmm. grab, mm -hmm. grab some of this oh you're matching this yeah. with food if you just want to get drunk and you know like play video games and you know just mm -hmm. hang out with your friends oh yeah this this if you want like cheap ass yeah. beer yeah that you want to just get fucked up on <laughs> beer you know and you want to get... like mix up uh, yeah soju, soju and you know like that. i think this is <clears throat> actually better than this for mixing like soju yeah. with because it, it doesn't have a really distinct taste right it doesn't you know, like just stand out. Yeah, it's just the function of beer. Mm -hmm. like, yeah, literally. The sole function of this yeah. is to make soul mac. There yeah. you go. That's uh, our picks. Yeah. This and I think this. And Cloud the B just OB. like this. Yeah. Yeah. The B picked. Yeah. OB, B, <laughs> OB yeah. beer. Yeah. It's oh B. So B. King. Oh wow. wow. Funny okay. David. So there you go. <laughs> That's our first episode of Korean booze. Hope we were helpful in picking uh, uh, the good beers out of all the crap uh, in this crappy domestic beer market. And once you come to Korea, maybe you guys can, you know, use our advice to pick your beer. 
And these are all beers, like I said, that you can find in any uh, convenience store on the street. Mm -hmm. So yeah, just use our advice. And we'll be back with more Korea booze. Um, next time with what? Soju? Oh yeah, soju. We'll do soju next time. Okay. Are you coming too? Next time? Uh, <laughs> if my fans yeah, look yeah. for me. Okay, oh. well you get free beer. Yeah, you get free beer. So pretty heavy budget here. Mm -hmm. This is a blockbuster. Yeah, that's it's like, like $10. It's fucking crazy. <laughs> and I can't believe I actually spent money on this shit yeah. <laughs> right here. Yeah. But there you go. That's uh, today's episode of Korean Booze. And hope you guys enjoyed it. Please like us, subscribe, follow us on Twitter, Instagram, here, here, here. And we will see you guys next time.